Yeah, question up the front, Darren. As, as you're commenting and um, doing all these blog networks and stuff, is it is it important to have um, people commenting back on your blog site? Like you had a hundred comments on your blog, does that mean you're more special now because of that? Yep, yep, good question. In the link. Yep. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> nice Thank you. Um, so the, uh, I, I think over time it will. Uh, at the moment, no. The aim of the game is all about getting links building in. Uh, but over time, think about it from in Google's eyes. Um, if you're getting lots of comments and people are engaging and all that type of thing, in Google's eyes, that would mean that you're more of an authority, you're more popular. So I think over time that will become more and more of an indicator, uh, particularly with the way Google just recently, I mean, they, they clearly know that Facebook is currently... Um, a huge competitor for them and Facebook's getting more traffic on a daily basis now than Google does. Uh, it's a different type of traffic because usually when you go to Facebook it's about engaging in community whereas uh, YouTube is about I have a problem, I'm, uh, sorry uh, Google is about I have a problem that I'm looking to solve but Facebook uh, and Google are now going head to head. Google knows that they're a, a big uh, competitor and they've just come out literally in the last couple of weeks and launched their Google Plus uh, which is their uh, their shot at trying to take Facebook down. They've kind of come out with their own little social networking uh, website. And I think that is a clear sign that Google knows that social is where it's at. Uh, and I think we're already starting to see more social indicators coming into the algorithms and influencing search. So when someone tweets about you and retweets, um, you know, that, that will become important. Uh, I think, you know, what your friends are saying about particular products and services and how many people like pages. Like, I mean, Facebook came out with their like button uh, and that's getting incorporated over into Bing. It had, I mean, Google and uh, Facebook uh, head-to-head arch nemesis. So Facebook just didn't want to hand over the data. They've, but they've gone over to their Google's biggest competitor and done a deal with them instead. Um, so I think we're going to see more and more of those things, but at the moment, not so much. Another question up the front here. Um, I don't know if you're going to cover this elsewhere, but um, and it's not so much about building links, but regularity of content, because local businesses often tend to like just put up a couple of pages and leave it. Do you think um, that putting up regular content is going is 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 more of a ranking factor now, or yep. isn't the class? Yeah. Uh, I think as far as adding that regular content, I can show you, like, I mean, when we made the decision and we shifted away from the stock market niche, uh, I haven't changed that meta formula website probably in about three years now. I've made very little changes and the the rankings still hold very, very strong. Uh, So I don't think it's a requirement that you add fresh content. I think that's a little bit of a myth. Like, I mean, a lot of people think that you have to add fresh content to your website to have it ranking. That said, though, building more pages is always a good idea. In the search engines, they say... Uh, every new page that you have is another ticket in the search engine lottery. Because if you imagine every page that we're creating, we're optimising for a new keyword. So the more pages that we have, the more chance we've got for coming up for keywords. So it's always a good idea to keep building as much content as you can. Big sites always win out in the search engines. So the bigger your site, the better. So the more that you can keep adding pages, the better off you're going to be. And that's particularly why uh, e-commerce websites do so well. I think Planet 13 is one of the websites, one of my most trafficked websites, but we have probably, I don't know, three, four thousand products on there, and every product has its own page. So it does particularly well in the search engines because we've got a lot of pages on it. So more pages is better.